Tetracyclines are swallowed, absorbed with low pH. Through the body they do flow, but not CSF, nay. They're transformed variably, and the 30S bind. They enter cells similarly to aminoglycosides. They can cause GI distress if given without food, or super infection stress, or a bad bone or tooth. Microbes resist by plasmids and drug stopping proteins. These drugs are bacteriostatic. Don't take them with dairy. Lincosamides or oral and go to the tissues, but not the CSF, no, the body the dust lose. Through the bile and urine, they work like macrolides. Skin and soft tissue infections are treated by lincosamides. They can cause GI distress, neutropenia rarely, sometimes also skin rashes, spectomycin mostly, works like aminoglycosides, it's given by IM, pain may be at the injection site, it can gonorrhea stem. Dalfopristine does reshape the 50S subunit. Quinupristine does blockade translocation in it. They can inhibit C, YP3A4, yes. They can infections relieve that resist vancomycin.